Okay, so today I'm going to show doing copy to or copy from uh, marketing documents, and those being a sales or a purchasing. So let's go ahead and go into purchasing and pull up a purchase quotation. I'm just going to go grab the last one that was done, and then from there down the right corner, we can do a copy to. So you can see that we can copy those into uh, several dozen things. In this case, we're just going to jump it up to the next document, which is a purchase order. And nice thing about that is it's bringing you all over the data to where um, if you're manually inputting that there's a higher chance that you may get the pricing wrong uh, quantity wrong uh, it's, you know specific so glance it over before you save it and then we'll just say add say yes so in this case then I can go back and I can pull up the uh, prior purchase order and again I can do a copy too in this case we can go to a goods receipt or an invoice or if we were to pull up a, an AP invoice and pull up this particular vendor. Yeah, it's this one here. And we can do a copy from. So if we go to the purchase orders, and we're going to get a list of the ones that are available. And it happens to be there's the one we did today. We say choose, go ahead and verify, finish, and we're set. So we can just say get some dates in there. If you just hit an alpha character and hit tab, it's going to automatically populate that information with today's date, or you can adjust it to the date you'd like. And we just say add, and say OK. And there we are. So that is how you can do copy to or copy from. I hope that helps. Thanks.